Today in this video, I'll be discussing about the Android M update on Lenovo K4 Note and then I'll be discussing about the bugs that I have been facing for around 2 weeks with Android M update. So that being said, let's get started. Let's take a look at the lock screen. You can see that dial pad is replaced by Google Voice recognition. Now you can access Google Voice directly from your lock screen. Let's take a look at the app drawer. You can find a new app search bar on the top left hand corner and recently closed app beside it. Now let's take a look at the notification panel. You will find a new tab of do not disturb. You can set your priority for 1 hour, 2 hour, 3 hours according to your need. Now let's take a look at the data settings. Now you can restrict the data on the data or of the data for any particular app. I don't like the default theme YBUI so I wish to change it. You can check this link from the link in the description of this video. Let's open the hotspot. Now you can set the frequency of your hotspot. Let's take a look at the apps. You can search for any particular app directly from here. Now let's open memory. You can find all your memory usage for previous hour. Fingerprint security is shifted to security tab. Now you can add up to 5 fingers in fingerprint security. Now you have got a new option of screen pinning which helps you to lock your screen to any particular app. For instance, I'll open YouTube. Now you can see that the screen is locked to YouTube. If I wish to unpin this screen, I need to hold the back button for 2 seconds. You have got a new tab of Google where you can manage all your Google accounts and Google connected apps. You have got a new sound setting where you can manage all your different types of volume setting individually. That's it guys, now I'll be discussing about the bugs that I am facing in Android M for the last 2 weeks. When I, whenever I use WhatsApp to make a call, microphone does not work. And the next bug is, whenever I tap on auto rotate, it does not work. And the last one is about the camera, whenever I click a photo, shutter sound is always on. That's it guys, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video and if you did, make sure to smash that like button and subscribe to this channel and share this video to your friends, let all the Lenovo users know about this.